we're going to pr print our nocturnal animal prints. And beforehand, what I've done is I have written my name on three sheets of black paper. That way I know that they're ready to go. And I have a brayer and I have some ink and I have my printing plate. Now I don't need to use all of this ink right away. So the way I get myself prepared is I take my brayer and I just tap it a little bit in there and then I'm going to roll backwards and sometimes I have to go a little bit this way to spread that across but notice how I'm not getting any ink on these areas of the plexiglass. I'm just keeping it in the center and if you listen carefully there's a sound that kind of sounds like velcro so that's what it should sound like. If you're not hearing that there's too much ink on there. So I'm going to go ahead and get a nice coat on there. I don't need to go back and forth like this because that will end up drying the ink out. And then I'm going to go ahead and roll that ink onto my printing block. And then I'm going to put it here. I want to make sure that when I put my print in the middle that I have it nice and square and then I want to turn this over and I want to use the side of my hand to add pressure to that printing plate. And then I can peel this away and I can see that the image has transferred. So this is a print, so we can make a second one. I'm going to add a little more ink on here. That first print seemed a little faint. The idea is to get a very clear image transferred, which is a little hard with this white ink on the right white printing plate to see at first. of my hand, peel away, that one's much nicer, cleaner look. And so I take that to the drying rack, then I'm going to work on my third print. Also trying to avoid getting fingerprints all around the edge of this. Alright, and there we are.